Pueblo Charter School is telling students to stay home. Teachers today saying to our investigative team, it has something to do with the dozens of cats and multiple skunks roaming that campus. Months ago, an investigator found that cats were crawling underneath one of the portable classrooms and may have caused a teacher to get sick. Investigative reporter Dan Beatty is live outside Dolores Huerta Preparatory High School after speaking with multiple teachers and the CEO of the school about the issues. Dan. For the past two days, students here at Dolores Huerta High School have been learning online from home. The charter school's administration told families the reasoning for this was because of a, quote, unforeseeable non-emergency circumstance. But for the past several school days, teachers that work here at Dolores Huerta tell 13 investigates the reason why they're reverting back to online from home learning is because the campus reeks of skunk. Whether it's the cats or skunks, animals have been a reoccurring issue for Dolores Huerta Preparatory High School since the school year began. Multiple teachers tell 13 Investigates animals have been living underneath one of the school's portable classrooms for months. One teacher even filed a complaint through the Occupational Safety and Health Administration, or OSHA, after a teacher experienced a severe allergic reaction. After the complaint, investigators were brought in by the charter school in November to survey the school's conditions. Not only did they find issues with multiple HVAC systems, they found entrances for cats to get under the crawl space of a classroom, as well as evidence of black mold and strong odor of cat urine. The investigators conclude that is, quote, certainly feasible that an employee with a cat allergy had a severe allergic reaction. Investigators recommend the school clean the HVAC systems, test the air quality, and remove the animals. In response to the original OSHA complaint from a teacher at the school, OSHA closed the case saying, quote, OSHA feels the case can be closed on the grounds that the hazardous conditions have been corrected or no longer exist. But several teachers fear that the problems have only persisted and aren't being properly addressed. 13 investigates reached out to Dolores Huerta High School to see how they are addressing the issues found in the investigative report. They tell 13 investigates this is a work in progress. The charter school's chief executive officer tells 13 investigates that they've humanely removed many of the animals from campus. They've cleaned uh, multiple HVAC systems in different classrooms. However, they have not tested the air quality in those classrooms. Teachers tell me that it's unclear if the parents of students that attend this school have been notified or made aware of the full circumstances surrounding the animals on campus. Reporting live in Pueblo, Dan Beatty, 13 Investigates. All right, Dan, thanks.